Hey guys, we've prepared 15 essential shortcuts that will help you to speed up your workflow in Satellite 3D. Take a snapshot. If you want to take a snapshot, press enter on your keyboard. This is the quickest way to save your setup in the timeline. And the best is, now that your setup is saved, you can move on to your next idea and of course, take more amazing snapshots. By the way, instead of using the shortcut, you can also click here or here. Navigation in the studio area. To move the view in the studio area, hold down the space bar and drag with the left mouse button pressed. To rotate the studio area, hold the right mouse button clicked and drag in any direction. In this way, you can also rotate the camera view in the preview camera here on the top right. Sometimes it will be necessary to adjust the rotation point while working on the setup. To set the rotation point to an object, select the object and press the key F on your keyboard. Now you can rotate around a light or around a model. This will help you in special when you're creating a new pose as it's easier to pose the model while you look at it from different angles. Adjust the working area. You can switch the preview camera and the studio area by pressing the key T. By the way, you can adjust the areas by dragging here or here. Press the key N to show or hide the studio library. Or press the key B to show or hide the detail settings. Rotate the camera or the light towards the model. Press the key E whenever you want to rotate the camera towards the model. If you have placed more than one model in the set, you can switch with every new command between the models. You can also use the same shortcut to rotate the light in the same way. Turn the solo mode on and off. You want to see how the individual light sources affect your image? Select any light and then press the key S to activate the solo mode. Now only the light from the selected light source is visible. This helps with fine tuning but also to better understand lighting setups. Try it out! Turn a light source on and off. To quickly turn a light on and off, select the light and then press the key Q. Multiple selection of objects. Select one object after another while holding down the control or command key. The selected elements can now be moved around in the room together or be deleted. This works in the studio area as well as in the set list. To cancel the selection, double click on an empty point in the room. Tip: If two or more light sources are selected, their light output can also be proportionately regulated together. To select all objects in your setup, use the shortcut Ctrl or Command A. To cancel the selection, double click on an empty point in the room. Notice, objects that you have locked in a set list or that are invisible will not respond to this command and thus not be moved. So make sure none of the objects you want to select is locked or invisible. Duplicate an object. Select an object, light or model and move it while holding down the ALT key. You will automatically receive and duplicate. Mirror an object. You can mirror a selected object or a pose with the shortcut M. Isn't that great? This can lead you to very interesting results. Copy and paste objects from set to set. Copy selected objects from a setup with Ctrl or Command plus C. 
Now, open another setup and paste them with Ctrl or Command plus V. This is very powerful. Try this shortcut also by copying a complete lighting arrangement from one setup to another. And that's it! I hope you use these tips in your own projects next time. And by the way, feel free to write us feedback. And of course, we're always happy to see what you're working on. If you would like to learn more tips and tricks for working with the lighting simulator, subscribe to our channel and make sure to check out our community, which is directly integrated in Satellite 3D. It is unbelievable how much you can learn from other users. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.